The sheriff's office is investigating a residential burglary spree in South Spokane County. The intruders have been targeting homes in the southern West Plains area around Cheney, Spangle, and the South Hill. KXLY Force Tanya Dahl is live along Yale Road tonight, north of Spangle, where several homes have been broken into. Tanya? Well, it's really isolated out here, Robin, and you'd think it would be easy to spot an outsider. But several homes in this neighborhood have been hit up within the past couple of weeks. One homeowner says that despite this security system, burglars took off with a laptop and cash. School and they take whatever they can get their hands on quickly. On this remote road, a group of people have been making the rounds targeting homes and walking away with stolen property. It runs the gamut. Uh, computers are very popular, cameras are very popular, um, firearms, in at least one instance they took a safe. Alarming news for Sophia Young, who moved here from Southern California four years ago with her husband to escape crime and crowds. And I was shocked that anything like that would happen that anybody would even attempt to come out here. Yeah, I'm home quite a bit, so, but it still makes you nervous. Brad Check, who has lived on Yale Road for 18 years, says he noticed a suspicious car the other day. But these days, it's hard to tell the difference between a neighbor and stranger. Now it's, uh, you know, a lot more rigs and stuff, a lot more people, so you just don't pay as much attention. The middle of the day heists aren't isolated to this neighborhood. The sheriff's office believes it's part of a burglary spree targeting communities across South Spokane County. They've hit somewhere between 12 and 15 residences. Um, there is stolen property that is being uh, trafficked through pawn shops. As investigators track down the culprits, Young and her neighbors plan on being careful. I'm not concerned. We have an alarm system and I do go to the rifle range and um, I practice and watchful. I think a guy is, you know, going to have to be kind of aware of what's going on from now on. And the sheriff's office says it has arrested four people in connection with these heists, but believe more people are involved and there are ways that you can protect yourself. The sheriff's office says join a neighborhood watch group. Make sure to itemize and jot down serial numbers for items like firearms and electronics. And when in doubt, you can always call Crime Check. Reporting live in Spangle, Tanya Dahl, KXLY4, HD News.